Hello. We are starting this week's vlog in London. We're on a secret mission. <laughs> it's a secret. Jamie's doing a public appearance at uh, Northern Decay. I don't know why I'm whispering when I catch it. <laughs> Jamie's doing a uh, public appearance at an Urban Decay event in London and um, no one who's attending as a guest knows that she's doing it. So we've been told that we have to arrive at a certain time, which is in the next 10 minutes, and then we've got to sneak into the building. <laughs> I like it. It's a mission impossible. Yeah, to be careful. It's for all the beauty advisors that work for Urban Decay. Yeah. It's like their annual conference full of school. <laughs> I hope no one's is disappointed. <laughs> right, we've, <laughs> we've seen our entrance. <laughs> Need a sail. Right, you ready to do this? Yeah. You're still getting this side. <laughs> I know, that's stupid. Right, go, 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 go. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Wow. How many people are here? Uh, like maybe 600. Maybe 600. That's my favourite one. What's that? Nectarine and raspberry, remember? Is it all freezing as well? Oh, yeah, it's got ice. Nice. Nice. So we just arrived to the green room. Chocolate. Jazzles. <gasps> Dazzles. Nice. For breakfast. Well, what did they say? Everyone's upstairs. Three floors above us. Three floors up. How much space we've got? I don't know. Do I cut wheel? I literally snapped my hand. <laughs> How fun. I know. I feel so secretive. It feels as if I shouldn't talk to her, did I? I'm going to do a tweet to show them off. You're going to tweet? Don't make it too obvious. Make it something like. Maybe I'll post a wee Instagram story at home. Something I've already. Aye, but remember it's time sensitive as well. So that's quarter past eleven. Something that's like something that you can't tell the time of day, or okay. something that's from the morning. I could post that and say a couch day with my dog. I don't know. I think that's obvious, man. I think it's too obviously trying to throw people off. No, it's not. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I think that sounds too obvious. I think no, people would be. I think people would be able to figure that out. And go. Not really? Yeah, maybe not. I don't know. I don't, so I don't be, know. They won't be looking for. They won't like. We're just thinking about it because we know that we're lying. Yeah, I suppose. But as they don't know we're lying. Right. Okay. Do it. How do you spell dog? D O G E. Okay. So here is the throw off story. No, I'm lying. Okay. Here is the lie. <laughs> Lazy Tuesdays with dog. <laughs> Finally binge watching Big Little Lies. <laughs> I've got my makeup on, but absolutely nothing on my eyes. So, also, I got new hair. I'm no longer platinum. We went for more of a kind of caramel, bronzed melt. I was just chatting to the guys from Urban, and I'm really excited because we have stuck 10 stickers underneath some of the guys' chairs, and at the end of my little setup thing, you say, check underneath your chair, and if you've got a sticker, you've won a palette, signed by moi. So I need to practice my signature. Oh God, that's see, I'm glad I did that. Oh God, I don't even sign it like that. Look. <laughs> and then yeah, we're just chilling. We're gonna get lunch in a wee bit, and we've got this big room to put on. Maybe I'll play a game or something. That was not a very good one, sorry. So we're still waiting on go time. What are you watching? Orange is the new black. Orange is the new black, cool. Got the camera all set up, ready to rock and roll. Did you sign them all? Yeah. Nice. Making good use of the commissaries, do you call them? Commissary? That's in jail, you get commissary. Yeah, well, we're kind of are in jail because we're not allowed to leave this room. Look at the size of this TV. That is absolutely massive, man. That's the biggest TV I've ever seen in my life. You can see me in it. <laughs> oh my god, that's big. There's like my hand to it, let's see. Yeah, there's my hand and size relation to it. Jeez, man. <laughs> you said T-H. E. You've also said the awakening. E. What? E. L. N for nutter. Is this a stupid one? No, Do I know it? You're meant to write down the letters I've guessed. Yeah, apart from the ones I've guessed. Oh. M for mother. Oh, no. G. For golf? <gasps> no! We can't play like that! No! T? I'm dead. What is it? Expendables. I've l I don't know what that is. Oh, that's bullshit, man. I'm not, I'm not playing. I'm watching my show again. Up. I'm so so we've been waiting in here for the last two hours while the conference goes on upstairs. We've got about another 10 minutes to wait and you're up. 
Why don't you do like some laps of the room? Psych yourself up, slap your face in that Rocky Balboa style. Dun dun da da dun da da dun da da dun 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 da da dun da da dun da da dun da 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 dun da 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 dun dun dun. You get bored. Look how cool that is. What is it? This is the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Heavy Metal Glitter Gel in Dreamland. Wow. Look. Wow. Did it work? Oh my God! Wow. Testing. Testing. Hello, I've not talked to you guys in ages. Well, you don't know that because it's just gone on to the next frame. Yesterday, I woke up, I was meant to go to PT, but the day before it was the meet and greet, not meet and greet, I was like a surprise guest, I guess, which was the best. It was really good. I was actually really nervous, but it was fab. That day ended up being like a 16 hour day, so it was a really long day, up at half five, and didn't get home till 11 at night. So me and Jack, we had a great sleep, and then when I woke up, I just really didn't want to go to PT. I really, I was just so tired. I started feeling that kind of not well way, you know, when you're just a bit run down, and I was like, I'm, I can't do it, man. We worked yesterday we actually got loads done for the home wedding which is perfect and yeah it just was it was a it was a productive day but i did it very grudgingly i moaned about it the whole day would you say that's right charlotte <laughs> hey, yeah kind of and then today i woke up and i went for a wee massage my back was starting to give me drip again and i, I never tell you guys where i go because i'm scared because i never get appointments but there is a place in the town in glasgow city center called jasmine Thai massage and they are so great i can always get an appointment you can just book online and you pay a deposit and then you can just turn up and i usually actually book the day before and then just go in but all the ladies that work there are so lovely and they kick the shit out of me yeah they say they probably beat you up Be yeah like but it's, it's like it's quite sore sometimes but it makes me feel so much better so i did that this morning uh hence why my face is all kind of like silly i'm just pure like play-doh today <laughs> I don't, yeah, no, I just couldn't be, couldn't be arsed in makeup today either. But I would say it's been a bit of a slow week, and I've actually seen on Twitter a few other people saying the same kind of thing. Everyone's like, whoa, like I'm pure tired. Mercury retrograde, you're right. The best thing you can do in Mercury retrograde is listen to your body, don't make any rash decisions either. Lie in a dark room. <laughs> but today, unboxed all the PR, recycled all the PR packaging. We're at same Sprays, Jack's getting his coat dry cleaned we're then going to go to a carpet slash floor fitting place because the office is nearly ready and i'm really excited mm. so we, all we need is a floor and then once we go to the floor place we're going to go to ikea i've got a wardrobe that i've designed online already the packs thing hi jack Yo. did you manage yeah really easy good and then we're going to get the wardrobe we're going to get a new set of drawers because we're just basically shuffling stuff around in the house and then after ikea we're going to get a coffee and then we're going to lush because i have not had a bath bomb in ages and me and charlotte have both been talking about going to lush so we're going to do that and that is our day of errands which actually is going to feel really good after we've done it also um i keep on getting like excitement in my heart because the home wedding's really soon and i'm so excited about it and then i'm really excited about never having to do any of this ever again <laughs> Seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> 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 Stupid. She'll probably have oh. a great hand spot. She'll be up above that condition or something. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. <laughs> uh, we've got a floor, by the way. So if we're looking at all these floors, we're going for that one. This is my favourite. Too warm, too light and dark, too grey, too light, too light, just right. The Goldilocks of laminate flooring. Look at this. IKEA has a flower shop. We have in our trolley big pasta bowls. 
We've got some ravioli. 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 Look at these. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start drinking a lot more wine now that we have proper wine glasses. And we've also got here some other glasses. This is for Jack's things. This is Charlotte's purse. There's Charlotte. There's Jack. We're buying some glasses and stuff because ever since we moved into because our house, turned into winos. winos. No, ever since we moved into our house, that was like over two years ago. We've not bought any kind of stuff for the kitchen since we moved in so, so loads of stuff's like kind of cracked or smashed loads of stuff's been smashed so we're just kind of replenishing a wee bit and then i think when we actually get the kitchen done up that's when we'll get new stuff yeah but we've had we've had all that stuff since overhaul. the flat that's been four years yeah we'll have a complete overhaul at some point when we get the kitchen done up probably yeah, for the time being we're just getting some cool wee items to take cool wee over. glasses yeah and i might get another plant i knew that was always going on the cards <laughs> where is she there she is found up the plants. Looking at it, should I get this one? Hmm, how's the greenness on it? Mm, pretty green. Should you smell it? Probably. Will I pretty kill this green. one? <laughs> Look how hard, I think I've ever seen her this happy when she comes to the plant Look section in Ikea. Groot. No, it looks like the wee thing that you pull out the ground in Harry Potter. What do you call them again? The mandrake? Aye, it looks like the mandrake. I'm buzzing. I better not keep me up at night. Let's see how long it takes her to pick her plant. <laughs> Five hours later. And here I found a Jenny. <laughs> Jenny 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 and he's away seeing one of his co comedians that he likes and having just a wee, a wee day with the boys. So, me and Charlotte, we're working all day today. Really good, exciting stuff that I can't tell you about, sorry. Um, yesterday though, we did all our things that I told you we were gonna do. We went to Ikea and I'll show you the spaces in a wee second, but basically I ordered a Pax wardrobe a Pax wardrobe, but that's the same thing that I've got in my makeup room. You guys love my makeup storage, and I love it too. Um, and I know there's a few other people that have kind of got the storage since then, and it's just it's just the best makeup storage ever. It's so great, and it's really affordable as well. I know that sometimes storage and wardrobes can cost a lot of money, but the IKEA pack stuff, it's not like the best in the world, but it does the trick totally. So I went online and I built another wardrobe for our spare bedroom. I got a big set of drawers, and they are actually getting delivered tomorrow, and they're getting built on. On Sunday so it's really exciting. We also ordered flooring which I'm so excited about. We found a really nice drama. <laughs> Hello. The flooring is ordered for the office which I'm so excited about. I'm going to do a little bit of online shopping today for office chairs. We need two office chairs and I cannot tell you how excited I am because the chairs that we sit on just now are the dining room chairs and yeah they're fine for sitting and having a meal but they're not very comfortable so we need comfy office chairs once the flooring's down we can move into the office which will take like a while but it will be so great after ikea yesterday we went to brayhead we actually got five guys it was amazing five guys i think is honestly my favorite burger we also went to lush bath bomb heaven so i thought what i would do is show you guys what i've got and put it in my basket this is a basket that i've got that sits in the bathroom a little bit unorthodox i actually like taking everything out of the packet and just sitting it in this big basket and it smells really nice it does dry out the products a bit quicker this is a lord of misrule from christmas time it does kind of dry the products out a little bit but it smells really good so i don't care oh bright side bubble bar fresh oranges Twilight bath bomb, one of my favourites, really nice to go to sleep. I got a lot of stuff by the way, I've not done a Lush shop in a really long time and baths are my favourite thing in the world so I went ham. Comforter bubble bar, my ultimate favourite. I'm getting bath bomb dust in my mouth. Another Twilight because I love them. Ah, uh, creamy candy bath, delicious. Ah. Uh, if you didn't know, they just now have comforter in a bath bomb. Un believable and if you didn't think i was shook enough another comforter wow rose jam bubble ruin half of it because i had half last night i got a lot of bath bombs this time which i actually prefer bubble bars but i got really excited about the bath bombs oh can't remember what this is but it's a new one don't know what it is wow another new one don't know what it is but it's like a rose oh very rosy ah 
Yuzu and Coco bath bomb version because Yuzu and Coco was a bubble rune and it's now discontinued. Ah, honey, I wash the kids is a soap. I used to sell it all the time in a bath bomb. Very excited. Guess who's having a bath tonight? Ah, that's like a proper sleepy time one. So this one has like a muslin cloth around it so it stops all the bits from going down the drain which is very important if you live in a farm and have a septic tank. Oh I don't know what this one is either. Oh it's a cinnamon one. It's a cinnamon and something else but I like it. It's quite herbal. Oh no that's a cinnamony one. Nice. So I'm going to save that for when I've got a sore body from PT. Whoa. That's a lot of bath bombs. Look at that. I'm going to get my bath bombs. Oh can I pick it up? Yes. Oh it's heavy. Look at those. And then what I do is I just pop them up there. Uh, go on. There we go. And I just stick them up there. And then these are all the salts I'm using just now. You guys know I actually got a really lovely delivery of Dr. Salts because they saw how much I love them. That one's actually finished. But yeah, I just love my salt bath. I love my bath bombs. Delighted. Also, this is one of my new plants here. He's nice. This is another one of my new plants, which I'm very excited about because I love my house looking like a garden center. So I'm really happy about that. I also got this little guy, look at him. Look how cute he is. He's got a wee face. So I've got a wee, it's like a wee bonsai, but he's definitely not bonsai. Also, look, my, my cousin and his wife got me and Jack this for our wedding present. And it's a sketch of Drogba. I think it's so cute. So we're leaving the bonsai here just now because we don't know where we want to keep him. What else did I get? I got one more plant. Where would it be? Aha! Look at this little guy. And that was my IKEA haul. That's what I got. I'm going to have a bath and chill. I'm going to watch my program. I've still not managed to watch Big Little Lies. But I'm going to watch Big Little Eyes and shop for office chairs. Perhaps, you know, a fun whiteboard for board meetings. And then also when all the IKEA stuff comes tomorrow, it's all going to get built on Sunday. On Sunday, I'm going to move all my stuff into the new wardrobe and drawers. So it's going to be a busy weekend, but it'll be a fun weekend because I'm at home and I'm just kind of like chilling. It's my favourite thing. Yeah, I'm excited. I mean, also, the makeup room's all tidy. Everything's just like good right now, so it'll be actually a really nice weekend at home because our lives are going to start getting a bit crazy again because we're going to start travelling again for work. We, we're we not travelling up to the wedding and we're not really, we're not really travelling in between our wedding and our wedding party, but we're, we're back to it. So it was nice because had, we had to say no to quite a lot of really fun stuff, but it was good. It was a good lesson to be able to say no. I don't really, I don't really say no that much. That's it, you guys. I actually think I need to probably do some shopping for clothes because I have been living in t-shirts and leggings for the last three to four months. So I'm gonna go and do that tonight as well. But it'll be good and it's sunny and work's done. So it's great. Hello. I just played around with some makeup just for fun. It's Saturday. IKEA got delivered. Uh, it was meant to be getting built tomorrow, but the company that they use now to build the stuff let me down. So it's, it's happening on Tuesday now instead. Essentially, we're getting the same thing, but all one unit for in here for my stuff. Instead of having all this stuff out, we're going to get the PAX wardrobes built there. So it's really exciting. This is actually our spare bedroom. And it's nice, but it just needs stuff on the walls and that. We need to dress it up a bit. I have not showed you guys this yet. If we go upstairs, basically because the wedding's done now, we can really get the house in ship shape. So this is going to be... Oh, it's creaky floor. This is going to be my new office. So I've got my lab downstairs, which is perfect for my makeup and my filming. There's not enough space in there to sit and do work, so we're, we've got all this done up. I've had new lights put in. All the walls have been all painted. The radiator's been all painted. It's all just been spruced up. It's not brand, brand new. We had to get that wall plastered. Is that what it's called? We've got a couple of wardrobes. These are not my favourite. Wardrobes that are built for this kind of ceiling are really expensive, so I'm just going to leave it. And then we're getting a floor put down next week. So we're getting a floor put down, and I've already bought the desk. And that's it, really. Jack had a really fun day out yesterday. He had a great time, and now we need to go and get some food. And just, it's been actually a really nice chill day today. I've watched all of Orange is the New Black. It's really good. Although I've not finished the last season, so please don't spoil it for me. Please. I'm on it just now. And then yeah, I just had a wee play around. This is the new Be Perfect palette with Stacey Marie, MUA, who I just think is so great and lovely. And that's really it for this week. 
You guys are going to start getting annoyed with me though because there's a lot of stuff that we're doing right now that we can't talk about. Which I'm really sorry, but it's worth it, I promise. Bye guys. Hello. I look like, a, like bald. T, T, T. T. <laughs> but we had, I can't do this, what, <laughs> what is going on? Yeah, it looks nice, just don't touch me. Don't, Jim. Don't, 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 don't. So the best thing you can do is oh. just, do you see that? Yeah. <laughs> is that a wasp? Yeah. Little bastard. Yeah, Me and Jack had this conversation, can you please shut that door? <laughs> bang, bang, bang. Bingo, bango. Bang. It's fine. It's, back, fine, it's, it fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Put it back. Put it back. Put it back. Fleming. Fleming spelt with a pH. Fleming. Ah! On our shoulder, what the heck? Ah! Right, if you can catch them, you can keep them. <laughs> and these are new leggings from Aloe Yoga. Very cool. It's kind of like down a wee bit as well. It's like lazy. <laughs> Think I what is going on with your eye? <laughs> you look like that skeleton. You know the skeleton that goes <laughs> and it's got his eyes pop out. Yeah. Is it sore? No. No. Maybe you just got so something you in your eye. It does feel kind of different. Like. Heavy. Well, you were out last night. Yeah, I know, but that shouldn't be affecting my eyeball. <laughs> I go to the doctors. No, you don't. <laughs>